know that you are financially straight. So they want to make sure that you are covered. But their intentions are still tied to this person if they're with somebody else. They take care of this person that they're with. This person trying to figure out any way they can to take care of this karmic versus releasing this person. Mm -hmm. They're holding on to a karmic debt. And they're coming in with manipulation to try to figure out how to get you to um, let them back into your life. Okay? We have dark intentions and a craving you. Okay? Dark intentions. Okay? This person's going to be coming in with some type of motive here. We also have uh, dark intentions. This person has a good time with you, then they ghost you. Okay? This person still has not changed. They have issues when it comes to women. Okay? So whoever this, if this, if this is a male and he's with a karmic, he don't respect that person either. This person has mother wounding. And when, like I told you guys, whenever a man has mother wounding, there's nothing that they can offer you but pain. Because they don't care about you as a woman. They don't give a damn about you. This person walks around in the fuck love energy here. And this situation, fuck love, when it comes to uh, mother wounding here, this person doesn't care. Okay? They're wounded. They don't care. They're not caring about anybody else but themselves. This person's panicking because they are going through a lot of things here. Okay? They can also have dark intentions to come in and burn you. So be careful. This person could also be trying to pass on to you what they have. Take it how it resonates to your story. Mm -hmm. They're trying to tie you to them. This person knows your worth now. Mm -hmm. They know. It's not a new beginning, though. It's a manipulation. This person's lonely wherever they are, too. Whatever connection that they're in, they're not happy. They're very lonely in this connection. But they still, this person still, look, what did I say? No new beginning. This is somebody divine masculine. This person's refusing to transform. It's not a new beginning here. Mm-mm. This person's coming in to play games. Somebody's about to go to jail, okay? And they don't have good intentions when it comes to the situation here with you. This person's going to jail. Somebody's going to jail here. Or about to be sentenced. Mm-hmm. And they want to make sure that some of them want to hook you to the D here. Or this person could be hooked on D behind the scene and not being honest. Whoever they're dealing with is probably hooked on their sex as well or manipulating them through sex. Mm hmm. But it's, gonna, it's not going to end well, the situation, whatever it is here. It's going to not end well. It's going to end well. It's going gonna, gonna to come in your favor here. The situation, somebody's craving you, but they got health problems. That's why they're staying hooked to the situation too because the karmic tie, health problems. This person, they also have, whoever they're with, has the whatever they have with the health problems, they both have it. This person just needs to stay stuck where they are. If they're coming in with bad intentions, their best bet is just to stay where they are. Mm -hmm. That's their best bet because you don't, um, God has you covered. Mm -hmm. And if they that the the the, the tower is gonna blow, well, justice is in your favor for those of you who have children with this person. They abandoned the kids. If they ghosted you guys and just left you out in the cold. You're now a boss, babe. You have your business. You're being very much blessed in your finances and in your life. Um, this person here is about to find out about this karmic person that they've been hooked to. The children are not there. So this person is gonna have a whammy upside their head. For all the stuff that they've done. That's why I said justice is going to be in your favor. Any slander, any lying, any character assassination, anything that was done to you is going to come out in your favor. Yep. So the boss, babe, the end one is your, you're good to go. Mm hmm. But this person's coming in with dark intentions when it comes to you. This is, this is your warning message. Or um, just to be aware, if it's already happened to you, then fine. But take it how it resonates, all right? Let's get started, y'all. Okay. <laughs> what is this message? What's dark intentions? And with dark intentions, it says um, wanting to control you. This person wants to keep control of you. They are they are mer they're very much they have a toxic. Um, they can't. They're not in love with you. They're not in love with themselves. Okay. This is somebody you could have been very much in love with. But this person does not know how to love. This person hates women, okay? And they see they, they see you as a opening to whatever they need as far as finances. They but they don't want to let go of the situation they're in either because the situation that they're in is very toxic. This person likes to live in a toxic energy.